Now, there's a united international push to improve multi-currency international payments to bring greater speed, transparency, availability and access to payments at lower costs. Instant credit transfers are key to improving cross-border payments. But it's being argued that the international financial community must act now and provide a compelling service or it faces being displaced. I'm joined now by Jose Luis Langer, Deputy Managing Director at EberPay, to look at this issue in more detail. Lovely to see you. My uh, pleasure. Thank you for joining us uh, here at Cybus TV and this penultimate day of Cybus 2022. I hope you've enjoyed it so far. We have enjoyed it very much. So let's talk about EberPay. Uh, who, who are they really in the European payments market? Yeah, EberPay is a, a payment processor in, in, operating in SEPA area in Europe and we uh, process account-to-account -account payments, uh, credit transfer, direct debits, instant payments and uh, our distinctive uh, features is, is that we use uh, technology as wisely as we can. We also uh, use uh, the staff uh, and, the, and the knowledge we, uh, we have in, in EberPay to provide a lot of services uh, on top of this, a lot of functionalities. We, are try, to, uh, we try to be as cost effective as, as possible because we live in a competitive market. And we are special, especially um, proud of uh, how can, uh, we, we have launched uh, instant payments in, in, in Spain and in Europe. Uh, and it's uh, a source of, uh, of uh, happiness for us because it is becoming a great success. So tell me a little, about, uh, a little bit about your journey so far, a bit about your experience in the launching of, of instant credit transfers. Yeah, we launched uh, instant credit transfers five years ago, more or less. And on the first day, the, the scheme was launched. Uh, it was uh, November uh, night, uh, 2017. And from the first day we operate, we had a, a good bunch of uh, banks uh, using the system. Uh, and from the first day, we also interconnect our system with the other system operating in Europe, RT1, uh, from EBA Clearing. Uh, and our aim was to uh, enroll as many banks as possible. Uh, we did it. Uh, we, we had a, a lot of um, uh, push uh, on, the, on the performance of the system. We tried to make it as instant as possible and we can make uh, transactions end-to-end -end in less than one second. Uh, precisely in 800 milliseconds could be at a credit transfer be sent from you to me and conf settlement is done, confirmation is, uh, is sent to both parties and uh, transaction is done. So it is a, a brilliant issue. When, uh, when we uh, make these uh, transactions happen with RT1, with TIPS and uh, the other system that, that launched the Euro system, it takes a little bit longer, 1.5 seconds, so it's very good. And, and the result is uh, we can reach 99% uh, of the current accounts in Spain. Uh, we can uh, offer a single window for the banks. They can send all, all instant credit trans transactions to EuroPay. We take care of those domestic and we send uh, those to RT1 or TIPS and, and, and we can offer a very cost effective uh, solution for our banks. Of course, it sounds like a fantastic service, but what are the missing pieces at the moment that can make SDT Instant a widely used payment instrument? Yeah, uh, the missing piece and probably the piece that we have in Spain and, and other, uh, other countries are lagging is Bizum. It's a peer-to-peer -peer mobile service. Probably you don't want to tell me your IBAN, your account number, but probably you, are, uh, you easily give me your f a mobile number. So you... Bizum can use this proxy, this mobile number, uh, to uh, send uh, a peer-to-peer -peer, uh, uh, payment instantly. So, uh, Bizum started with this peer-to-peer -peer mobile, uh, mobile service for pushing payments. So, it's a, a kind of pay -em in, in in the UK. And uh, uh, they got uh, traction very, very, very soon. Now, uh, we have 22 million users uh, using Bizum in Spain. So if you are not a Bizumer in Spain, if you are, don't use Bizum, you are lost. You will not be, be on, on this moment. And not, you can not only send payments, but request a payment. Uh, you owe me a beer, uh, give, me, give, me, <laughs> give me my money back. Uh, you can uh, also uh, make, uh, make donations to non-governmental organizations, 7,000 of them. 
So you can give charities, and this is important. We have a purpose, uh, and, and, and we are proud of that. And, and now we are, in the, our business is entering the e-commerce space. So uh, 37,000 uh, shops online where you can buy shops using Eastern payments. Uh, on the, and the underlying uh, payment instrument is always uh, East, uh, Eastern credit transfers. And we make it happen. It's a, it's a combination of overlying service and even pay uh, uh, on behalf. I'll be honest, Jose, you nearly lost me on getting your beer money back, but you won me over, <laughs> you won me over on charitable donations. Uh, so tell me why instant credit transfers may be a good fit for cross-border transactions. Yeah, it's, uh, some of the features that uh, we've got in, uh, with uh, instant credit transfers, you can reach any account. You can do it uh, very quickly. You can do it uh, seamless. You can do it uh, with, any f uh, with no friction. You can apply those good features not only for domestic payments, but for international payments. And if we connect two instant payment systems with the help of, uh, of uh, SWIFT or others uh, which are in the middle, we can offer a, a, nice, a nice service to, uh, to, the, to the clients. It, and and it could be individuals, could be corporates, could be worker remittances. We can do a lot of uh, things and we can improve uh, in, international cross-border payments which are lagging a little bit behind. When you send a cross-border transaction, it doesn't take uh, w less than one second. It mm -hmm. takes long. It, it, it doesn't cost a, a fraction of a, euro, uh, of a euro cent. It costs uh, many euros. Uh, there, is no, uh, f there are many frictions. There are many uh, things that we can improve using the technology that it is working uh, uh, very well uh, and at a domestic level. And not surprisingly, there are plenty of initiatives, GPI Instant, uh, uh, GPI Go uh, from SWIFT, but there are many others, and they are all based on existing rails of uh, Eastern payments, which are working perfectly fine. Well, sadly, time is not our friend, Jose, but it's been lovely to speak to you. Thank you so much for joining us here on Pleasure. Cybers TV, and we'll talk about the beer money later on. That's uh, Jose Luis Langa, Deputy Managing Director at IberPay. Thanks for joining us. My pleasure.